Marlow with the 80 millimeter turbo trying to lay into it. Go look at that. 436 at 172 with that little itty bitty turbo. Unbelievable. Nest the God. <laughs> What's happening everybody? It is your boy Ken O'Shawn with Blue Over Media and yes, today I have part two of the baddest four eyes in the world. Now before I get into all of that, I got a special announcement to make on today. Today is the launch of the brand new website, blueovalmedia.com. Yes, I finally got it done. I'm still working out some kinks, but because I'm so anxious to show you all, you all, I want you to go and check out the website, blueovermedia.com. It's where you can get this, this apparel, the blueovermedia.com hoodies and t-shirts. And it's also where you can register for doo -doo -doo -doo, the Lead Ford Blue Fest 2021. That's right. You can get the t-shirts from here as well, as you can see right there. And then also it has the uh, registration link um, for how you can get tickets. I'm going to start uh, getting the hotel and accommodations and everything else on there as well. And so, man, you all, when you get a chance, check out blueovalmedia.com. All right, now, without further ado, let's just get right into it. Today, I got a lot of good ones on here today and I want you all to check them out. The first one goes out to my man at the Chris Leonard. He has an 86 GT T-top with only 50,000 miles. He's owed it since he was 13. Man, oh, that's he only before he could even drive it. It's got a, a mare, a three inch wide body kit on it, uh, work three piece wheels, um, forged coyote with voodoo heads, comp cams, gen three intake, long tube headers. I mean, he has the works on this car, all right? And so you all, I could go in into a whole lot of stuff, IRS, all the stuff that he has, but why don't you do me a favor and check out my man at the Chris Leonard. So in the last video, I had people talking about, man, why you don't have no convertibles in here? Like, wh where are the convertibles at? Well, for part two, I got the answer for you. So right now, I got a convertible for you, and it goes out to my man at 4IFRK. And he has an 85 GT convertible, 393 Windsor, Team Z rear end setup, and it's just a beautiful, beautiful convertible. And so, check them out.
when we start talking about modular swaps, you know I'm always a big fan of it. And my next one goes out to at Brian77 Garage. He has an 86 GT with a Gen 1 Coyote swap. Shout out to all you modular motor guys. Sitting on UPR coilovers, BBK Lone 2 headers, Flowmaster mufflers, 373 gears. And man, you know, what he wanted to keep the stock look, you know, for the sleeper appearance. So when you see him, don't pull up because you may think that he has a uh, small horsepower, but he might actually shock you with that coyote. So this one goes out to my man, Brian. to at Lubner 82 now this is the first time I've ever heard of one like this it's a coupe it's an 81 Mustang Gia coupe G H I A hopefully I'm saying that right but it's also coyote swapped as well it has a gen 1 coyote 6r80 trans um, powered by the hour power ugh, powered by the hour harness <laughs> you gotta slow down to say that right a few times uh, 2004 Mach 1 brakes, maximum motorsport suspension, and all type of good stuff. And so, man, this car was very, very nice and very clean. So, shout out to Lovner82. Next one that I have coming up, um, it is a RS Capri. And this one goes out to my man Robert Wright. Now, I don't believe Robert had an Instagram, but he did send this to me. And, you know, this was actually one of the first times that I've ever even like seen a, a, a Capri um, that looks like this. And so it's a 4i84 Capri. And Robert Wright, you have an amazing looking car, and I had to put it on the channel. So shout out to you. out to the person that intro the beginning of the video now man when he sent me this stuff I literally had my mouth to the floor when you saw those times that he was running in the quarter and I'm this 86 GT is amazing it's owned and driven by my man David Farlow um, it has a 25.3 chassis by 10 soldier race cars it has a 5.4 32 valve modular motor doo, 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 doo. shout out to you modular motor guys all right uh gt supercar block um stock gt 500 crank gt 500 heads and cam package by modular head shop and i mean he has 10 team z front suspension trz rear suspension i mean this car is ready if you see this car at the track i i'm just gonna spectate because i have nothing crazy i'm not talking that talk to this guy shout out to you david farlow i really appreciated this car and what you have done with it and you running those 
crazy quarter mile times with Ford Power. I love it. Shout out to you. You think me on the door. about this next car coming up is that he has the same wheels as I do and uh, man these wheels have become popular over the last two to three years on Mustangs and uh, man I love it like I love when I see them and so this one goes out to my man at money pit underscore 1986 now he has a four eye that's only a two on a car all original paint from 86 and it's a t-top car 331 cut boss block 76 millimeter uh, precision turbo. I mean, this car makes 690 real horsepower on pump gas at 13 psi. And so, man, I'm I'm excited about it. I'm gonna love to see what this car does when it's on E85. And um, he has a new setup coming up. So shout out to my man at Money Pit underscore 1986. Next one that's coming up. Um, I love it when guys know how to pick the right setup for their car and have you know the appearance. You know, some guys are about speed, some guys are about appearance, some guys are about both. And I love the overall combination of this car right here. This one goes out to my man Sean Dice at 86 Fatal Fox. He has some very expensive wheels on here, the Bose Forge, and for you all to know, those wheels are not cheap. And it is just a pretty amazing and a pretty looking car. And so check out 86 Fatal Fox. last one um man i this car right here amazed me okay um i actually had to reach out to i found this car late uh, i nominated this person myself once i saw the car um somehow i was on instagram and and, and just was looking through and just kind of found this car here and so man this one goes out to at like the underscore sauce man and it's another modular swapped um for i 
Gen 1 Coyote, 492 wheel, um, built by Triple Six Motorsports, um, LM uh, Stage 3 cams, um, full MMR billet timing, um, and he got the oil pump gears in it. GT350 intake, BBK long tube headers, a Viper Spec T56, 04 Cobra IRS, Maxon Motorsports suspension, K member control arm, Steeder bump steer kit, and the list goes on and on and on. But I just really like this car and you know shout out to him and one of the things i really like about him is that you know he shouted out his friends who helped him big to build his car and if you all don't know um for what i understand at staying domination one of the youtube channels that i really enjoy they helped him build this car as well and so shout out to uh staying d you know man those guys are amazing i love watching them and i love to see what they're doing so check out at like the underscore sauce So that is part two, you all, of what I have for you on today. Just do me a favor, make sure you go to blueovermedia.com to check out all of the apparel and all of the new things that we have going on um, on the website. And then also make sure you get your Bleed for Blue Fest t-shirts or your Blue Over Media hoodie. I am ready to ship that out to you. But also, thank you all from the bottom of my heart for supporting this channel. Um, by the time this video hit, I would either be close to 10,000 subscribers or I would have passed it uh, by then. And so I'm asking you, if you like this forward content and great forward content, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe and man, keep on uh, the support. That's how I'm able to keep doing these videos for you all. So thank you so much. It is your boy, Ken O'Shawn with Blue Over Media and I am out.